Hi friends, welcome back to Arc Tutorials. This is JavaScript interview question and answer series. Today's episode, the question is, what is the output of the following code? Take a look at the code and guess what is the output of this particular code snippet. Right? So usually the question around this is, what is the length of the array after deletion? Right? So basically you have an array right? and you de are deleting a item from element from in that array. So what's the length? So take a look at it. There are five elements in this particular array. You are deleting one. What is the expected length? If you set four, right? Then catch your ears because it's actually five. So whenever, whenever we delete something from an array, uh, it doesn't delete the length, right? It will delete the element, but there is an element, right? Don't believe me. Let me show you. All right. So, okay. So let me put it here. So let's say I have um, let's say students equal to. So I'm going to keep it simple, right? By the way, do let me know if you have any friends who just have names like A, B, C, D. <laughs> All right. If you have one, please do let me know in the comment section. So here we are deleting uh, the second element from this array. Now let's do console dot log and say students right dot length simple nothing fancy we have um, array um, so we have an array and we are just deleting the element number which is of index 2 and we are printing the length let's see that in output alrighty so console log okay so let's clear this um and okay uh that's not the really so i know you would be confused because of the other ones um so what i'm going to do is I'm just going to comment off the previous code uh, those are all the other examples i had covered earlier so make sure that you check that out if you're interested in learning more about the interview question answers all righty so the first one that you see is number five which is what is our students thing so don't believe me um, students length after deletion is it's a student length after deletion is still five right see here so this is just usually um, a question that's often asked to trick the candidates in terms of uh, testing them um, whether they really know how what happens with the array what would be the behavior etc i hope uh, this was tricky for you i'll keep bringing i know i've got a lot of feedback that bring back more advanced tricky questions trust me the coming um, in the coming episodes i'm going to make really really tricky questions for you let's see how much you can weigh yourself all right thank you for joining in this episode till then keep learning keep growing don't forget to subscribe to Arc Tutorials. Thank you so much. 